Hello, and welcome to another exciting episode of The Chronicles of Crazies. My name is Cassie. Today we'll be playing The Legend of Zelda Oracle of Ages. Now let's see if I can remember how to do this. No. No. Okay. So that's a B button. We're gonna be Link today because why not be the true name of a hero? I like it a little fast. I'm sorry for this number down here if you guys can see it. Except our quest hero! Bushes, can't get rid of these things. School swamp, by glass lake, foreign village. Hello! You're awake! Please relax, join our jovial troop of performers for a bit. Who are you? Din has been caring for you since she found you. She's strong willed but very kind hearted. Ah, Din. Always looks so lovely. She seems smitten with you. I'm jealous. Uh, don't be jelly. Don't be hating. Din is a popular dancer, and just seeing her dance raises one spirits. Oh, your eyes have opened. Are you all right? I am Impa, the troop's cook. And you are? Link? I see. Din, the dancing girl, found you collapsed in the woods. She's cared for you through your nightmares. Oh, that's nice. Can I walk? Oh, I can't, can't touch the fire. Hey. Hey. Hey, listen to me. You've awakened! Good, I worried while you slept. You're Link, right? How do you do, Link? I am Din. I saw a red flash in the woods, and when I went to see what it was, you were lying there. Mystery surrounds you, Link. I'm just glad you're better. Come, won't you dance with me? Yeah, how do I do that? Don't be shy, dancing will be fun. Oh, look, Din Link can't dance, but look at Din! Meow. That was fun. You're a good dancer. It's been some time since I had such fun. Hey, your left hand. It has a triangle on it. That is a sacred mark in Hyrule. If it's the true symbol, then you are a hero with a special fate, Link. A special fate. Link, I, um... Nothing! Let us dance! So, she's hiding something. Uh-oh. No! No, everybody! No! No! What is it? What's happening? ha ha I found you, Din, Oracle of Seasons. You hid yourself well, but you cannot escape Onyx, General of Darkness. Oh uh, no, everybody! Ah! Uh, what are you doing, Onyx? What are you doing, Giant Tornado? Link, do something. Get out of my way, boy. Link, you're useless. Ah, Link! Link, go get it. Nope. Link, you're not good at this. That's Onyx's tower. That's not kinky. What do you do to... What do you plan to do with me? As you know, if I imprison the Oracle of Seasons and bury the temple that houses the season spirits, the seasons of Holodrum will cast into chaos, the bountiful gifts of nature will rot, and all living things perish. That is the world of darkness that I long for. No, Onyx, no! Ha ha ha! Crystals? Very classy for, uh... Game Boy Color standards. Yeah! Now she's in a crystal. Why does this seem vaguely familiar? Oracle, or, uh, oh, great, of time. Down, Temple of Seasons. Spring, summer, fall, winter. Fall into chaos. Ah, oh, there it goes. Wah, 
<laughs> Link, get up. Input, just drag him inside. Link, are you alright? Actually, I am the nurse of Hyrule's Princess Zelda, and Din's no dancer either. She is actually the Oracle of Seasons, who wields control over the forces of nature. Zelda has mystical powers that told of a, cert a curtain of shadow drawing around Din. I was instructed to take her to Hyrule in secret. Zelda gave me this quest, but ow, I've been wounded and I won't be able to travel for some time. Link, I know not why you were lying in the woods, but you and Din were fated to meet. If the triangle on your left hand is real, then you may be the hero who will save the world. Please, use your power to aid Din. Please, take my message to the Maku Tree in Horon Village. Maku Tree is the guardian of Ahalodrum. Surely he can help. Uh, oh, but, but. Please take my message to blah 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 blah. Alright. Sorry. Sorry, I get a little excited. So, um, let's, let's look around. I uh, can't do anything with that. can go that way. Hello? Look! No matter how much I call her, my precious mittens won't come down. If only I had her favorite treat, fish. Remember that guy for later. Can't do anything about that. Right. Meow, meow, meow. Mittens. Meow. Uh, so... A little history about this game. Like, personal history, not game history. Uh, wait a second. It was win win spring? Winter? Spring? Hello? This is Horon Village. Hey, I've never seen you before. The Makutri head east. Hey, kid. Kid. Get up here. If you get into the flower, you can shoot up the cliff, too. It works only in spring, when flowers bloom. So I'm getting my fill of it. Um, so as you can see, the map is... Made up of a bunch of squares. It's quite lovely. Quite lovely, Gamna. Yeah, I do. Hello? It goes from hot to cold in a flash. The seasons are in utter chaos. What will it do to this year's harvest? But you can... This is the house of the wise know all birds. See them if you have questions. Um, I'll just look in here. These are just tutorial birds if you need it. I don't need them because I know what I'm doing. Here. No. I can't. Oh, that's the next place. We're not going that way yet. So the history of this game for me. This game came out in 2001. The seasons are a mess. Winter goes straight into summer. What's going on? Um. Actually, I'll get into personal things later. Where I'm going to show off the town first. I'm sorry, sir. You cannot enter here without a member's card. Are you curious? What's back there? It's a secret. <laughs> you don't have anything for sale. You're a lame shopkeeper. We'll get to the Maku tree, I promise. I'm just... I just... I have to explore. Ah! I'm Bippin, the expert arborist. I know plenty about trees. Now let me tell you something. Blossom and I, and I just had our first child. Yes, we did. Have a look. Oh, he's so excited. I am Blossom. This is my first child. A healthy baby boy, but I'm having trouble choosing a name. Can you help me think of one? What would you call him? This is in reference to Cafe, the unique character from Majora's Mask. He was not a reskin from Ocarina of Time, and he's by far one of my favorite characters in the entire Zelda series. You would name him Cafe? Yes. It's a fine name. That's what I'll call him. He seems happy to have it. Come visit us anytime. So, as you progress through the game, make sure you come by and see these people because little Cafe here will grow up. Don't worry about it. Uh, he's a. Remember, he said Bippin's an arborist, so he's planting trees and stuff. Burr, burr, burr. Nah, I can't go that way yet. Doo, doo, doo. that. Hello, our guardian, the Maku tree, stands beyond the gate to the east of town. It said a hero with a sword will come to speak with him. I wonder if it's true. Well, I don't have a sword. 
Do you know of the Hero's Cave near the western coast? The Hero Sword is said to be hidden in there, but no one has ever found it. Don't worry about that, I'll find it, because I'm like... Mayor Ghoul's residence, the Makutri. Uh, here's a clock shop. Hello? I want to make a cuckoo clock, better than any before, but I can't find a wooden bird that I like. One that's just breathtaking. We'll find you one, dude. Just like we'll find that guy some fish. Uh, here's Mayor Rule's house. Hello. This is the mayor's home. The mayor is fascinated with gasha nuts now. The place planted, planter and the planter's deeds affect what the nut produces. The mayor found a good place recently, so he's quite happy. Gasha nuts are a new... Uh, not new, but they were revolutionary for this game. This game contains rings and other unique items. Gasha nuts, depending on how many monsters you kill... Uh, produce different results. I'm Rule, Mayor of Horon Village. Do you have any Gasha seeds? If you plant one in soft earth, it will grow into a tree that bears nuts. Inside those nuts, you'll find all sorts of things. It's so fun, I can't help myself. There's some soft earth just outside. Plant it there. You don't know about Gasha seeds? You're missing out. I'll give you my prized Gasha, gasha seed to welcome you to town. There's some soft earth just outside, plant it there, blah blah blah. Uh, this is bombable wall, but we can't do anything about that yet, because, well, we have no items. Uh, that's a select screen. Ah, here's a start screen, here's the item screen. Uh, oh yeah, you can switch between screens with select. And there's your save. Blah blah blah. Uh, so why not? Let's... Yeah, let's plant a gosh seed. What the heck? There's a piece of heart there. I don't know, a piece of heart. Ah, what are you... Uh, I'm gonna find out what you are. So this one's just gonna be exploring. Do come in. I am Vasu, the jeweler. Is this your first time? Then let me explain jewelry. Rings made from mystical seeds have very mystical powers. If you wear one, its mystical power will be passed to you. But you must keep it in your ring box. Mystical power will gradually weaken and you won't be able to use it. Understood? Yes. Oh, you don't have a ring box? I like you, so here, take this ring box. Yeah, level one ring box. It can hold one ring. That's awesome. Take this ring as a sign of our friendship. You got a ring. Get it appraised later. Until you've had a ring appraised and its power revealed, you cannot wear it. Let's appraise it. Which one shall I appraise? Appraise this? Yes. Blah, blah, blah. I see. I call this the friendship ring. Symbol of a meeting. I'll appraise this for free this time, but after this it will be 20 rupees per ring. If you get two of the same ring, I'll buy one for 30 rupees. Now the list, now the list. Praised rings get added to the list. When you want a ring, move it from your list to your box. Talk to me to see your list. Let's take a peek at it now. Ah, blah, blah. Okay. Rings do nothing unless more, so let's put it on since he's obviously like hinting at something so you just you hit A to equip it it's pretty pretty basic um here's some snakes here I am blue snake I give ring fortunes would you like a ring fortune no because I have no rupees you're leaving come again soon red snake and you want to ask about rings no he just he's a ring tutorial person blah 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 we don't need that we don't need you rings ring snakes um that's an odd looking tree. Um, hello? Hmm, the light in here is too dim to read by. Can anyone light my fire? That's a big hint. Side quiz end up starting with him, so we'll, we'll figure it out later. Um, Maku Tree Gate. Show courage to gain passage. Hey. Okay. So, hello? Can't wake him up. In the west part of town are the know-it-all birds. See them if you want to have a question. Go over here, puppy. No. So! The game already told us what we need to do. I just wanted to show off the town a little bit. So, um, I'm going to make this a little bit of a longer episode since it's, so far it's been like tutorial, not no action. Um, I will say... 
I will talk about my personal history with this game. This game came out in 2001. I was about 11 years old when this game came out, and I only had a NES, a Sega Genesis, Great Fairy Fountain if we need it, we don't need it. And, well, I had a Game Boy Color, and I had two games for that Game Boy Color, and I was happy. So, the two games I had were Dinosaur and Logical. Dinosaur was based on the movie that came out around that time. Logical was a big marble game. I can't go that way yet. I'm just exploring. I'm showing off the area. Um, one Christmas, my grandmother took me and my sister out shopping. And she goes, well, pick something you'd like for Christmas. Heroes Cape. So, I looked at the games. And I was like, huh. I decided that I wanted a game. I had decided I wanted a game. So I looked and looked. And this a game in a blue box caught my eye. Oracle of Ages, the sister game to this one. And I said, I want that game. And my dad said, are you, are you sure? I said, yes, I absolutely want that game. He said, all right. So we got the game, and I absolutely fell in love. Absolutely. We got a key. So you can use it to open locked door chest in this, or locked door block in this dungeon. I really love this game. Um, I should say, and I'm sure you're wondering, well, why are you playing Oracle of Seasons? My sister got the Oracle of Seasons game while well, I got the Oracle of Ages game. You want to know why? Because Oracle of Ages was in a blue box. I'm not even joking. So that is why I got this game. Or I'm playing... Or... I don't know what I was what I was talking about. So she got she got one in a blue box, or I got one in the blue box because my favorite color is blue. She got the one in the red box because her favorite color is pink or red. Blah blah blah. It's just telling you basic stuff, how you use your sword, all that good stuff. But it wasn't done in there. No, whatever. So now that we have that, we can actually fight. Um, there's a hole here, so let's check it out. So the reason I'm playing this game first is because this game was the one I actually beat first. I actually really struggled with Oracle of Ages because I got stuck on the, um, or I got stuck in, come on, I got stuck in the third dungeon, so I was like, and I played this one. I actually don't like this game as much, but I thought I would play it first, show it off, and and save my my favorite of these two for blah blah blah. Stop it for another day. Can walk on snow if it has footprints. So as you can see, the seasons are way out of whack. Hey, there's stuff on that tree. We actually can't get that stuff yet, but that's okay. We're gonna come over here. We're gonna awaken the sleeping man. Nope. There we go. Hey, it's nice and green here. Hey, Mr. McCoutry. This was clever. Bam! What? Who's that? Did you wake me? Who are you? Hmm. What? Din was taken while I slept. There's no sign of the Temple of Seasons. This is awful. Guarding the Oracle is my duty, and you were sleeping. You were sleeping. 
Alas, how I've withered! What's to be done, Link? With the seasons in chaos, the land is robbed of the very essence of nature, draining all of my might. Can you save Din in my stead? It is all that this Mithkutri has ever asked. I sense evil on the northern peak, where the Temple of Seasons rested. Onyx has, create, has cast a shadow on the northern peak. I think you will find him there. You'll need the eight essences of nature that lie sleeping in, the, in Holodrum. Gathering all eight is the only option. The essences possess the sacred power of nature with which you can break the shadow barrier and save Din. Shall I repeat it? No! Then I give you this key. Go to the giant root near the lake up north. The first essence should be there, but I'd expect some resistance. Be careful. I'll just, um, rest until... Oh, no energy. So the Makutri. A little quick, little tidbit before we end it. The Makutri is a descendant of the Deku Tree. Oracle of Seasons and Oracle of Ages comes down the split timeline theory in the path, in the official Nintendo release path of Ganon actually winning during Ocarina of Time. This is the first in that line, the next being the original Legend of Zelda, and after that, Legend of Zelda Adventure of Link. This is the Maku Tree, thought to be a reincarnation of the Deku Tree. There's also Maku Tree in the other game, in the land of Labrina. But that's for another day. For now, we're going to call it here. Alright, next time on the Chronicles of Crazies, we will be going to the first dungeon. Alright, see you guys next time.